friends, this video on understanding elementary shapes part 23 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So based on this basic knowledge on three dimensional shapes, let us try some questions. Question number one, a cube is a cuboid whose edges are all of equal length. So the only difference between a cube and a cuboid is that the faces in a cuboid are rectangles, but the faces in a cube are squares. So now when you have all the faces squared, so that means that all the edges will be of equal length. So you have to tell how many faces, edges and vertices are there in a cube. So when you talk about a cube, all the sides are of equal length. So let's try to analyze the faces first. So this is front face, face number one. So we will have a, similarly we will have a back face. So let us call that back face as face number two. So face number two is the back face. So we will draw the back face with a dotted line. So this is our back face. So one is the front face, two is the back face. Three is the top face. So this top face is nothing but a square. Similarly, you will have a bottom face. That, let's call that four. This is the side face which is five. So similarly, this side also you will have a side face which is six. So total how many faces? We have six faces and each face is a two dimensional square. How many edges are there? So you see how many line segments? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine are clearly visible and three are hidden because they are on the back side. One, two and three. So total 12 edges. And how many vertices, how many points are there where the edges meet? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. So there are eight vertices. Question number two, a square pyramid has a square as its base. Now what is a pyramid? So pyramid is a structure which is formed in such a way that you have a polygon base and then you have triangles as all other faces. So here you can see this is a polygon. So this is the base of the polygon, the square, the square form. Let's name the square as ABCD. So ABCD is the base and then you have these kind of uh, triangular faces and all these triangular faces get connected to a point at certain height. So that's how a square pyramid is made. So here also you have to tell the number of faces, edges and corners. Corners are nothing but vertices. Let's look at the faces first. So here we have the bottom face as square. So let's number the bottom face as one. And then how many triangular faces you have? So there are two side faces triangular. So these are number two and three. So there is one triangular face at the back, this triangular face at the back. And there is one triangular face at the front. This, this one is the front face. So that is five. So total number of faces, five. So how many the out of that four triangular faces and one square faces. How many sides do we have? Let's count the line segment one, two. So this is one, this is two, this is three, this is four, this is five, this is six, this is seven and this is eight. So there are total eight edges. How about corners? So this is one corner because here the edges meet. This is another corner, this is another corner, this is another corner and this is yet another corner. So there are five corners or five vertices. Question number three, match the following. So here we have certain images and we have to tell the name of each of them. So cone, how does a cone look like? So cone, whenever you think of a cone, think of an ice cream cone. So it is like a circular base and then you have a triangular top or, and it can be the upside down as well. So this is a cone. Sphere. Sphere is your ball. So sphere is not a circle but it is made up of many circles. So many circles together when they are stacked in a circular fashion they make a sphere. Cylinder. So cylinder we have will have circular base, circular top but in between it will have a rectangular body. So you see a rectangular body, circular top, circular bottom. Cuboid. So cuboid is just like the matchbox where you have rectangular faces forming a cuboid. Pyramid. 
just now we discussed now pyramid can be a triangular base pyramid or a square base pyramid so here you have one base which is a polygon basically and then from that base from each side of that base there is one one triangular faces and all those triangular faces they get connected at a certain point so here you see the base itself is a triangle this is the base this is one triangular face this is another triangular face and there is one more triangular face which is at the back which is not visible to us so this is a triangular pyramid so if in case you are more curious to know or to visualize more three dimensional shapes you can refer the video on three dimensional shapes of class 7 mathematics so there we have done some practical demonstrations also to give you better visualization of three dimensional shapes so with this we have reached towards the end of this lesson and i hope that this lesson would have uh, given you some idea about the various elementary shapes try to look at objects around you and analyze what kind of shape is that and i'm sure that's going to enhance your knowledge so i hope this lesson would have helped you see you all in the next lesson thank you please visit examfear.com for free quality education you can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons you can ask your questions you can refer notes and you can take a free online test we have content for class 6 to 12 on physics chemistry mathematics and biology along with practical videos so please subscribe to our channel for daily updates thank you